All right, so this has no name on it, but it's incredibly cool. So I gotta get it. Okay, so this is made in Canada. Somebody will buy it. Just gotta be careful, there's a thermometer in it. I don't want that to fall. Avon. I just don't know anything about Avon. I passed up Avon at other places. I don't want any of that either. Did you see that TV? Yep. And I know it's not going anywhere. I know it's going to be right there until the end. Are these Bluetooth candles? No way. Huh. I don't want them. They're cool. Oh, that's a smart bulb. We can use that. So we got the elf. Cole's cares. I don't know. Nobody picked up plush except to give them to their dogs. Hometown products. Made in China. That's old. Look at that. This is very old. I have no idea on anything. But I know it could be worth something. I said Levi's on it. I'm on the Wi-Fi in here, but I don't always have time to look stuff up. Where's your stuff? Uh, it's in my friend's basket. Oh, that's how you work. Let her push, yep. push the cart and you just shop. been by this table like half a dozen times but you might miss something yep. what's the year on this one uh, I'm old enough I don't need any more books oh, maybe one fish two fish some of these are worth something Because it's not politically correct. Random house. Where's the date on this one? 60. That might be one of them. We're going to take a chance on that book. Okay. Would have had a lens in it. Okay, so this this is a black crystal made in Poland. I've sold something similar to this. Not exactly like this, but um, it has all the package and everything. Easy to ship. Great item. And it's got the original box. So, I'm going to get this and um, Let's do a trick. Let's scan this thing. It's a rose bowl. And let's see if she will scan. We have wireless internet, so. Nothing came up. Doesn't mean that it's not there. Okay, there's a 
crack over here. It doesn't look old. So again, we have filled up the vehicle. There is stuff in the back seat. Um, the, tr the trunk part of the Explorer is full. Um, it was a race, a marathon. It was very cool. Um, not everything in here is going to be flipped. Some of it will be kept uh, because we can use it. So we're going to go to the back seat. And um, there's a laptop there. I'm going to reuse that. Um, this was pretty exciting. These are uh, parts for a 70s, 60s home light. That right there is a treasure trove. I've got a guy who bought some from me before. I'm going to reach out to him and see if he's interested in these, maybe. Um, he likes pulling saws. Uh, there are two TVs that are vintage. This one here is a Hitachi. A Hitachi. And um, it has uh, RCA jacks on it. Up front is a Toshiba that uh, uh, has the instruction manual. So, some cool stuff. This enamelware we might keep or give as a gift. Um, there's some things in there I bought as supplies um, for us to use in our sale. There's some unique things in there. I didn't look up anything except for two items. And, um, uh, you know, when you get it cheap enough, it doesn't matter. You know, I'm, I'm tempted to go back in. I saw a few things and um, I'm tempted to go back in and get more because uh, they do go to tomorrow, but they got to deal with this stuff and they want it gone. And it's for a good cause, uh, the Humane Society. And um, so I might go back and look uh, more thoroughly at some stuff I didn't. So I might just do that and uh, see what happens. So I've got a few more bags. I might take those and just fill those up um and go back in but because cool stuff and some stuff that i can use personally and um we're, we might go back in so all right <laughs> okay so we're back and uh stuff has been picked through so now we're going to see what's left because sometimes there's some good stuff not necessarily ab un above the table but under the table so we're going to take a look and see what's here Multi-function headwear. Hmm. Oh, see? Oop, that's my bag. See, I told you we'll find stuff, and we did. These are cool. Those I'm going to keep. So, we came back in and looked around and found these roller skates. Which I didn't see the first time. So we're going to keep on looking. This is really cool. Cabbage Patch diapers. I found those. I said I wasn't going to get any more, but I did. Great shape. Sounds like a piece of furniture fell over. Yeah. But I don't want those. Not the only one. Oh, it's a speedometer. I'm gonna get that. That's new. New old stock. I'm going to ruin something in there. I don't know a whole lot about some of the parts, but I know that they're valuable. Ah, uh, cat freshener. I can't turn that down. Uh, no books. Unless they're Bibles. And I have a Bible like that. I don't want it anymore. So 
So I decided I was gonna get that Panasonic stereo. It had the needle for it. So I decided I would take it. Um, I gotta make room in the vehicle for it. I really only want it for myself. Then I can listen to albums if I want. Part of my reasoning for that is that I'm so tired of streaming a little bit. It is nice to have streaming, but if I have a, and listen to some different music and get some unique stuff, that's kind of why I'm, my interest is in it, so. All right, we are here at the vehicle again, and we are going to find room for that uh, stereo. <laughs> Hey, Podunk Picker here. I'm um, on the water here. It's in the evening. And I want to tell you about the sale that I went to. Um, at the end there, I did pick up that uh, turntable with a tape deck and the radio. I wanted to use that in my work area, play albums, do something a little different than just listening to streaming music. When I tested it out, that um, unit did not work, but the tape player worked and the radio did. I was bummed, but maybe I can repair it, you know, get a new belt or whatever and fix it. So it was a great sale. This, the second and third times I went, I picked up some amazing stuff that I missed the first time. So when you go to a big sale, don't forget to go maybe go back again and look around if you're looking for stuff to flip or you're just looking for stuff you want to find yourself. So. Thank you, and I appreciate your watching and subscribing to my videos. And here you go. Here's a little bit more of Moran Bay. Thank you. Like and subscribe to my channel, Podunk Picker.